Maybe you didn't hear that. Uh, we're doing a truck video here. We got our patches. Um, I put them in here. Uh, just a channel update and some uh, sad news, uh, family-wise. Um, I've been battling COVID for the last three weeks. I still got some of the fatigue and uh, being uh, uh, out of breath easily uh, when doing anything like walking from the truck up the driveway to the house uh, wears me out. So a uh, bit out of work uh, because of the COVID. So, uh, you know, that's to be expected. Uh, burning up um, savings from that. Uh, so Victoria brung it in from school, uh, which they weren't practicing social distancing, social distancing or wearing masks. Which I'm okay about not to wear the mask part, but uh, they weren't social distancing. And, um, you know, obviously somebody sent their damn kid to school sick with COVID. Or Victoria never would have brought it home. So, Victoria brings it home. My wife gets exposed to it almost two days before I do. Uh, about two days after I get, or yeah, two days after I get sick. I end up going to uh, urgent care along with Victoria. We get tested. We tested positive for the Delta variant. We go home. We isolate ourselves from my our grandson and my wife best we could. Basically, um, we got a three-bedroom house. So uh, I stayed in mine. Victoria stayed in hers. Or we interacted since we were both sick. Um, so that's why the videos you've been watching for the last two, three weeks have all been either uh, baseball card ones that I did for Emmett, which were already scheduled in some uh, some older uh, videos that I had up, except for the Anderson video, which we did the other day um, and put up. Um, so in saying that, that was why you're seeing more baseball card videos than anything. Those were just to be spread out when I did a video that uh, did not get monetized. Um, that video would be, and we wouldn't lose any revenue from uh, YouTube ads. So anyway, um, Victoria gets the COVID. About, they don't give her any medicine whatsoever. Five days later, she's good to go, ready to go back to school. Well, I'm still laying in the bed hurting. Even my hair hurts. Um, anyway... So into our second week of COVID, I'm starting to feel a little bit better. Victoria's back to normal. Um, doesn't affect Emmett at all. At all, you know, he's only two, so uh, COVID didn't do nothing to him. He just went on like normal. Um, but my wife ends up getting it uh, towards the end of uh, our uh, my stint with it. So, which is good because both of us can't be sick at the same time. Somebody's got to take care of him and, and um, Victoria's got to go to school. So, uh, and Jessica came back home uh, this week. So, uh, that helps out a lot. But, um, this past Sunday, uh, I had to send my wife to the hospital. Um, she was having a hard time breathing and uh, she's already a stroke survivor from six years so she starts spacing out a little bit long story short she spends a week in the hospital uh, we bring her home Sunday um, which would have been the 12th I thought, yeah 12th we run her home the 12th she spent seven days in the hospital uh, she still had five more days of COVID medicine to do and um, Bring her home Monday. She's still weak, hard to breathe. I uh, found out she had a couple blood clots in her legs. Uh, they, they said they were real small in both sides, and they were giving her medicine to break it up. Um, so we set her up uh, where she can uh, she hardly get up and sit down because of the blood clots. So, but anyway, we got her situated in the front room there, um, watching TV and all that, and she spent 
roughly eight hours at the house. Um, about 6 a.m., Victoria gets up and checks on her. She's still in there. Um, grunting a little bit because of the pain, which is understandable. And we get up about uh, three or four hours later, and my wife passed away um, sometime during 6 a.m. and, and uh, 11 a.m. Totally unexpected. The doctors told us that uh, she should be full recovery in two to three weeks, and she would be good to go again. So big surprise, uh, obviously, uh, the doctor didn't know his ass from a hole in the ground, and we've lost, I've lost my wife, and the girls have lost their mother. Um, Jennifer and I have been together for 20 years. So videos will be spotty for the rest of this month. I do want to get back to a normal routine as fast as possible because that'll help, that'll help me heal. Uh, it'll help Victoria heal and help Jessica heal. Um, Emmett really doesn't realize, you know, he's only two, that his mammal is gone. Um, he calls out for her every once in a while, but with Jessica being back home, um, his mother, so that's easier for him because, you know, he'll just go to mommy. But, yeah, so that's why I've been spotty on channels and this and that. And uh, our videos, have, I had a lot of baseball card videos versus uh, all that. Everything that I've had in the bank scheduled to come out uh, throughout the first couple weeks of uh, September and the last two weeks of August were already pre-recorded and they're just waiting to drop. I'm, I like to be about two weeks ahead of time. Uh, on our videos because that way you never know when something happens like this so yeah it's a tough time this is probably take 52 of me trying to make this video and let you guys have an update I appreciate all of our subscribers um, that watch the channel um, comments and all that all that helps us out a lot um, it keeps our mind off uh, off Jennifer's passing for now until we can heal emotionally and uh, so, just give you an update. The videos are coming. Um, the 1100 giveaway is coming. Um, we're going to do those videos probably tomorrow um, on Saturday. Uh, my wife's service will be on Sunday, so there will be no videos on Sunday, of course. And uh, hopefully I can get back to work Tuesday by Tuesday. So, um, and then we'll start doing our videos again. Um, because that's really the best way to heal is to keep busy as long as we're keeping busy we'll be all right but anyway again just want to give you an update all on all that and um we appreciate you guys watching the channel we appreciate all the old subscribers the new subscribers that we got i think we're a couple away from 1200 with it when i'm when this video is posting that's great i uh, appreciate you guys all uh, our follow our fellow youtubers that have reached out to us appreciate all y'all um as well and Talk to your doctor um, and make sure that the shot's right for you. Uh, Jennifer and I were doing that in, well, about a week before we caught COVID. Uh, we were waiting for a cardiologist, um, her stroke doctor, and, and uh, give us the approval um, to do that because of the clotting issues that, like Johnson & Johnson had and some of the other ones. We want to make sure we get one that doesn't have any clotting issues um, for her or for me because we both have, um, well, she had stroke issues and I have uh, AFib issues from the past that we're trying, you know, we're trying to fix. Um, and that's why we waited and didn't get the shot immediately because we had to talk to our doctors. Um, now that Victoria and I have had it, we can't get the shot for 90 days because we have the antibodies already. So. Um, but talk to your doctor about the shot um, and see which one's right for you. Um, I'm not an anti-vaxxer. I'm not a pro-vaxxer either. I don't like how fast it came out, all this and that. Um, tells me that it was man-made. So, uh, but yeah, if you need to get the poke, uh, get it. Um, 
we just the Johnson Johnson was the one we didn't get because you were one and done but then they had clotting issues so that brought up issues with the other two so you know I had to find out which one was going to be the best for us and basically um, I don't know we really don't know what um, killed Jennifer because there's no autopsy being done um, since she passed away at home uh, they did an investigation obviously no foul play duh uh, so since she has COVID uh, automatic COVID death she'll be marked as that because she had it unfortunately so anyway long story short that's why uh, we hadn't been producing a lot of gun videos versus baseball card videos the last of the there's still two more baseball card videos coming out um, and then our, our giveaway we're gonna do uh, a three giveaway uh, first second and third uh, places um, and you got to comment on the videos on each video and then that's what you'll you'll uh, be ready for so or what you'll be registered for so if you don't comment on the and we're going to do third place first second place and then first place the grand prize um, those were all these were things that have been donated to the channel or um, have been used by the channel and um, patches and stickers and gun parts and things of that nature that uh, we've tested or whatever and then uh, so you don't have to worry about that and we'll just send those out when we get the winners done um, we'll do all three videos at the same time basically anyway just talk to your doctor about getting a poke which one's right for you um, if you do get it don't go home and try to separate and try to isolate yourself at the house go spend two weeks in a motel room it'd be cheaper and safer for your family um, as always from the girls and I uh, we appreciate you folks and it costs nothing to be kind to one another and the way this country is going right now we need a whole lot of kindness and uh, as always we'll catch you next time